The Department of Environmental Affairs Green Fund was established in 2012 to catalyze South Africa's transition to a green economy. Our innovative Green Fund is one of the first of its kind in Africa. An inclusive green economy for South Africa offers a groundbreaking alternative for our economic development. A green economy is built on low carbon emissions, resource efficiency, and social inclusiveness. Developing a green economy also provides a way for South Africa to meet its global commitments to the Paris Agreement and the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. The Green Fund has an allocation of 1.1 billion rand. Currently, a total of 55 projects are financed. This includes investment, research, and capacity building projects. Our Green Fund seeks to fund innovative and high impact projects that have the potential to be replicated and upscaled. We want to develop appropriate technology for our diverse ecosystems and communities. And in so doing, conserve our natural resources, uplift our communities, and stimulate green economic development. South Africa is rich in biodiversity, varied environments, and natural resources. Yet, it is also water scarce. Our resources need to be sustainably used and protected. Often, indigenous knowledge can lead the way. This community has been progressive. They've chosen to take their land and create a new protected area. And with that, develop something for their community. So we're trying to make sure we marry and cover all our bases of community development, protected area management, and priority species reintroductions. Fund projects have successfully demonstrated how green development can be linked to social upliftment. If I'm coming from work during the night, I didn't see my house properly because I'm coming uh, dark at that time. But it's fine now because there's a light outside. It changed my life because I'm watching TV, I listen to the news, and even my child now is to, when I get to read the books like uh, right now, not for a length. At first, I was at home, I used to work at the local salon, and then now I'm a lot more confident, I'm free, I am just growing every day in the workplace. When you go around, it's like, you're a woman carrying a step ladder, and it's like, yeah, it's my job and I enjoy it. Are you going to climb on top of my roof? Yes, I have to. So, we, we get that remarks a lot. When I received the call, they said UCV is being received there, I was clapping my hands. I didn't sleep even at night. Thinking to know my dream has been fulfilled now. I'll be there because I was dreaming to be a nature conservationist. The Green Fund supports green technologies that offer sustainable solutions for waste management, transport, renewable energy, and biodiversity management. We specialize in biogas plants. We take aerobic material that can ferment and we generate um, biomethane from that and then we run an engine that makes electricity and that's how we process biomass. It is definitely something that, that can be applied or rolled out. Op die plaas is het ons met kyk na die dieren gezond is, ons met kyk dat hulle productief is en hulle waterpunte moet ons na kyk. Ons beskerm die skaap is soos om die kollers om te sit en ons jachters uit te sit. Ons mag ons nou nie dieren dood maak nie. That is our hoof point on the place, we have to live with our children. It's fascinating um, with my background of electrical engineering. So when I came in, um, there was this solar thing and I never have worked with solar. Now uh, that I've worked with it, the new tech that is coming in, new things you learn every day. People with solar panels, um, they have light, they have TV, they, they are safe, less um, risk of fire. So, they enjoy.
job creation and training, as well as growing the knowledge base of the green economy, are key impacts of the Green Fund related to economic development. We are the biggest employer in the area, which probably sees around about two and a half to three million rand being paid directly into those individuals' pockets, which benefits the community. They are part and stakeholders of this reserve. They're passionate, they're driven. So with the Green Fund project, it's built a base on the reserve. It's made it attractive and shown that this is viable. Donors, international and both local, are, are very interested in the project because it's showing success and it's a sure investment. This is the hatchery. It's kind of like a nursery. This is where all the breeding takes place. And we, as a hatchery, are supposed to produce 20 tons fish per month for the for production tunnels. But from March month, it will be 80,000 tons of fish. In general, our approach and our vision is that green technologies are quite well suited to an incremental delivery model and that, that together with innovative business models that uh, capture opportunities for local job creation and local economic development uh, can be combined for a process that can see a staged upgrading of informal settlements. Green jobs, it's not just jobs, it's jobs that are interesting, meaningful, relevant to the way the world is moving. The Green Fund brings South Africans together, based on our shared passion for this beautiful land, to innovate and to find green solutions that foster more equitable social and economic development. By channeling investment towards climate resilient development, the protection of natural capital, and a diversified and vibrant economy, the Green Fund is committed to the long-term future of South Africa.